What's up guys? It's Brent back here. And we're going back into some more Slay the Spire Downfall. Well, not Downfall. I keep saying it. I need to change the Library of Runa. Uninstalling Downfall could do that, but at the same time, I like having it here. Last time we played as the Watcher, and we did a couple different runs. Got pretty far. Um, I think most notable would have probably been... Not the scrawl. Oh, the follow through. That's what we were doing, where we were trying to follow through and then follow through into follow through. This time we're doing Ironclad and we're turning off Ascension. I'm tired of losing as badly. So let's try this and see if it helps. Ascension level nothing. Go into here. Um, max HP, not really exciting me. Random rare card could be good. Or enemies in our next three combat have one HP. I don't think I've seen that yet. Did we get a bunch of elites? Probably not. Um, there's a pretty good path though in the center here. Good amount of rest. Upgraded. I think I'll take the random rare card. Eclipse. Exhaust your hand and replace it with random cards that cost one less than normal. Well, that's a choice. Refund one. Definitely a choice. I guess that's what we're playing to. Okay, defend and then get that strike out here. So hope everyone is doing good. It is a lovely, normal, not great, average Monday. Um, but it is a thing here. I want to try this eclipse out. I hope you guys are doing well. Ooh. Okay. Is it only attacks? No random cards. We just happen to get only attacks. Um, anger first probably here. And then we can headbutt you. Toss that anger back on top. We good. Wild strike and clash. Okay. I'm pretty happy with that. But like I said, I hope everyone is doing good. I had a pretty normal, pretty full day. Relatively boring. But, you know, that is kind of how working goes. We're going to trigger trap. 32. Well, half is 20. I mean... Go for the, 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 yep, and then we dodge out of the way. Calipers as the reward. Very good. Now here's the, the crossroads, the decider. Calipers leans into a block build. And you can do a very good block build with Ironclad. Strike to strike, it is early. However, we're exhausting a lot of our cards. So, I don't know exactly how that plays. I think... I think I have a high damage card. I think I'll take Iron Wave. Try to build up the defensive. We've seen being defensive and offensive um, in this mod does work pretty well. Oh, and this is one time where it doesn't. Uh, Thunderclap, we're going to... Ugh. Headbutt. My true grit here? I don't really want Juggernaut, so... Okay. Sometimes it does not work very well, but they stay... Yeah, they just stay less as like a lower cost, which is pretty good. Interesting, interesting. Um, what other things to talk about? Um, I know people were asking if I had got around to looking at the Library of Runa showcase to see the gameplay, which I still haven't. Um, just been busy, you know. Work stuff, had did some stuff with friends over the weekend, had D&D &D for the first time in a long time. Um, then we had a double date, wife and I, so it was, it's been busy, but at the same time, it was pretty good. It's good to relax. Uh, I'll probably look maybe later this week. I also want to get some more other content put out, so we'll see. We'll play, we're playing about year. Um, we're going to offer something here. Okay. So we know we can upgrade or get something new. I think I want the upgrade on, really quick. I don't want to click it and mistake this. It comes back to you and it costs zero until played. Strike from Hell works with Eclipse. I think I just want the damage on Carnage, though. If I'm really honest. Okay. Let's do Carnage here, and we're going to just do... Oh, Nunjaku is good. But no, I just wanted Carnage Plus. Okay. But yeah, that's kind of my game plan for getting around to watching it, or if I can, even. Um, but it's still on, on my list of things. Uh, to look into. I have not forgotten about it. Exhaust up to three cards. Draw one card for each. Add a void to your discard pile. 
No, so three. Up to three cards. Aw. Oh. Abandon kind of works with this. Um, we're kind of building to an exhaust build. Works with the strike from hell. We really would want more of them to kind of take advantage of it. Ah, oh, gemstone gun would have been really good too. I think. Wild strike's not bad in an exhaust build. I think I will take the one abandoned. I don't think I'll take a wild strike for cash. I think I'll hold off on that. Let's smith. Um, exhaust to four. I don't really care to play it more. Let's go with the refund one on the eclipse. Seems like a pretty good, pretty good go. Uh, Carnage here. Right. Oh, that's it. Would we want to draw two cards? No. There's nothing we can draw into that would excite me. Take the eight here. The only thing I'm kind of like sad about, I guess, is we're not really playing into the advantage of calipers. Um, so I'd like to do that if we can. And there's ghostly armor. That does do it. Like, assist in that. Because, but it's a little less. But it's a good block, as, is what I was insinuating. 13. I'd rather think get the, yeah. Iron waves damage and block increases, which I think is much better. Iron hammer. During the first turn, drawing card upgrades it. Okay. With the abandon, that could be very good. Because we could end up... Uh, exhausting three, draw three, and they will all be upgraded. Uh, dum dum dum. I think we'll just go for the elite. And this is the one I'd want to fight if we had to fight any of them. And there's the abandon. Oh, they're all upgraded too. Interesting. I forgot that's how that worked. Um, I think I'll play the defend. Oh, we're out of energy though. I could abandon here. At least a strike to get an upgraded strike. Didn't work out the best way. I was hoping to upgrade a better card, but it's fine. Ended up working out. I think we're going to go for high damage here. Take the 18 to the chin, but in the end, we will get the uh, the kill on this other bot this turn. This is definitely a hand. Um, We need nine to kill them. Ugh. I mean, we're going to go for the eclipse here. Refund one. Ghostly armor did not exhaust. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. Uh, and then Strike from Hell comes back. We need to get it upgraded. It does 20 damage now, though. Um, Sword Boomer right here. Um, 20 and you. 18 and you. Let's True Grit. A random card. Okay, but that's seven. And I can only play one of these. I guess we just go for Perfected Strike. I think it matters. Usually armor's gone, but I'm not too sad about it. Okay. Um, perfected. The Thin Body Slam Strike. Uh, I think if I would've played not the Defend, I probably could've got out of this without taking more damage. Didn't count my maths. But it's all good. Warrior Anathopter's fine. Not exciting, but... Uh, Sever Soul actually kind of fits into what we're kind of doing here. Uh, we really need more strikes from Hell to uh, really incentivize doing this more. Um, we're going to go with the Ghostly Armor, Carnage, and then we're going to do the same thing as last time. I'm not going to do both of these. We got double defend. All good. Um, we'll go with the Bash, we'll go with the defend, and then we'll end it right there. Eclipse, yeah, isn't going to be that great in this hand. Um, but I'm kind of... Kind of game for it. Alright, that's not bad. Fiendfire, exhaust your hand. Um, Thunderclap. I think we're just going to go with the... Um, more exciting... Hit him for a couple times. Yeah, then we put the Thunderclap back in. Bash, perfected. There we go. Wraps it up pretty nicely. 10% chance to dodge. I mean, it's not bad. Anger, uh, broken deal, 18 damage now. I don't think any of those are quite necessary. Um, I think I will take the seventh bullet. Uh, we have a little sustain in the burning blood, so I'm not too sad to take to get the strength and take a little bit of damage here. Um, ghostly armor's not too shabby. 
I think we're just gonna go with the yeah, double strike here. Kill this one next turn. Maybe even eclipse into some AoE to make it a little bit more beneficial. Let's abandon first. I'm gonna do it on these two. We do add two voids, which sucks. Um, hit you, hit you. Didn't end up mattering. Pummel. No, strike from hell. There we go. That's what we're looking for. I'm gonna pick them up when I see them. Start of combat, draw an extra card for each innate card in your deck. Not quite. I need more things that benefit from being exhausted. I don't see any. Usually strength equal to the unblocked damage dealt. Ooh. Ooh. Equal to. Uh, and it's not. Oh, no, it is this turn. Never mind. I thought it was just they lost strength. Um, I think we'll go card removal here. Make the deck a little bit more consistent. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. And we have the music. Music man, who I am pretty okay with fighting. Um, break some hell being upgraded are going to be good because they will be zero if we get to eclipse them. And this is a fine turn to... I don't know if the eclipse will work with the iron hammer. But I think I'm going to go pretty heavy into this first. There's the strike from hell. Then we eclipse it. That one comes back at zero. Then, um, yeah, burning pack, exhaust one card, comes back, draw some more, they're all upgraded. Okay, that worked fairly well. There we go. All right, I think that's as much um, value we can get out of an opening turn, really. But I'm pretty okay with that. All right, there's the carnage. Never so well all non-attacks though, that's the downside. Um, I think we're just gonna go Carnage and hit him there. I think we're okay currently. We do have the Power Potion if we decide we need it. Uh, first, oh well, we can, it's considered an attack, so. We will, um, hmm. Yeah, it's gonna be Ghostly Armor, then Sever Soul. Cause we get the chairs out. We still get to play the rest of the cards. Still gonna take a little bit of damage, but we mitigated it, I think, for the most part. Um, Burning Pact. Do that. And then I figured we could abandon some other cards, but actually I will go with the Abandon U2. Actually, just go for all three of them. Yeah, and they're all added back. Uh, let's go ahead and just get rid of the second chair. And let's... Dual wield the strike. There we go. Start playing him out here. We still have two energy. He's not doing any damage. So I think we just go with the carnage for 30. All right, we're taking two from Fervent Everett. At the start of your turn, draw one card. At the end of our turn, third one. Okay. Um, we definitely want to go uh, Burning Pact first, I guess. Thank you. And there's a def defend plus. 25 will kill us. So I want a sever soul. I did want a sever soul, but mm, it's going to exhaust the defend. Now I draw the play the defend and we'll, we'll get rid of the chair. Not the best, but we still survived. We only need to do 41 damage. So, and there's our cards to do so. Um, we only have two energy, but we're going to exhaust all three of these cards. And put right back in, but uh, dual wield this, and that's more than enough to end this fight. All right, pretty happy with that. There's fiend fire, exhaust your hand. I don't need a second eclipse. It's a little high roll. Um, I think I, I'll have a fiend fire. It fits really well. We still need to add some cards to it, but draw one fewer card each turn. Eh. No longer see the map I don't like. Less map info. I think I'll take the Royal Gob Goblet here. I can always add draw to the deck, technically. Oh, and there's Arcanine Joker, man. Okay, that's gonna be a hard one. I don't know if we're really prepared for him. A lot of rest, which means lots of upgrades. Ooh, here's a good one too, though. I'm pretty... I mean, that's not the worst. A lot of early shops, though. I'd rather go up this question mark path, and then we'll cut fully across. I think I like that better. 
Okay. Scarecrow men. There's the abandon. So we will, yep. Choose to exhaust that. Diver soul. No, I don't want to do that. Well, I still. M yeah, we'll still do that anyway, actually. That. Strike from here. And then we'll do 24 to you. Alright. I really miss our judgments that we had last one. There's such an easy way to, like, close out a fight. We're gonna do this, then we're gonna eclipse. We get two, um. Juggernaut, and then this true grit here. Does five damage. Only a block. Okay. Fiend fire, I'm okay. Ah, uh, it's not. Uh, mm hmm. Fiend fire is it, like, I'll kill one of them, but. The other one will definitely survive. Let's defend and then we'll fiend fire, I guess. That was not good. Oh, they got the carnage and defend. Okay. Uh, Sever Soul here does 24 to 1. Yeah, we got this. So we do this, do this, and then Sever Soul. Um, sharpness Potion. We'll drop that for the Power Potion. It'll be very good in the long... We'll probably pop some of these on the next boss fight since we've seen how it went last time. Uh, we do need more card draw. And this does draw two cards. It's a little bit of a band-aid, but it does work. And there's the Pommel Strike. First thing. Oh, and there's the Abandon. Um, I wish Fiendfire was AOE, more AoE than just targeted. Because I'm more likely, I think, to Carnage and get one of these out of here. Yeah. And then we'll just go to the armor. I think I'll abandon the strike just to do so. Yeah. And we just upgraded one. All right. Oh, this is a terrible hand. But I guess it gets rid of the paralysis. So. Outside of these guys, they heal. So you got to be really careful on like how we're handling this. Doing in this order here. Oh, one's dead. Eight more, so... Paralysis again, but here we go. These are the kind of turns we need. So Strike will come back. We can hit him with that. We can close line, which we should have started with, but they're dead anyway. Don't need the smoke bomb. Bloodletting. Ooh. I think we would want like an unceasing top for that. Like it's good, it's already upgraded, but I don't think we have the value to really use it. Uh do 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 do. Our casualties, uh, I don't think we've seen this one. Our casualty rates have skyrocketed over the past few months. This rate, our attrition is unsustainable. At this rate, our association will cease to be relevant. The woman pounded her fist on the table. Something needed to be done. Either we make an effort to improve our training and equipment, or we make efforts to scout out the monasteries before facing them. So scouting or training. Mm -hmm. Compromise. Rare card's fine. I'd rather keep the gold for, like, late line shop, maybe, with these question marks. Uh, the ego card, they're fine, but I want to see what the compromise is. Gals, such half-hearted does not suit you, Director. But I respect your judgment this time. Oh. Free from the memory. There's actually no... I thought that it would continue the conversation. I guess that was, uh, that on my part. Uh, this one's when we, we can only play... Two and one. Or two and two. We don't want to play three. Or we suffer a negative. Oh, we're going to play three this time, definitely. Um, oops. Or probably most definitely. Iron wave. Actually, go ahead with the clothesline. Um. Your attacks, we get weak. I really don't want to be weak, so. We'll take it. Bean fire. That's. 927. For each card exhausted. Eh, not the best. We'll go with the bash and then the fiend fire. So, get him pretty close to the next turn. Right. Iron wave. Almost strike. We're just going to go for the kill. Here we go. Intimidate wild strike. Nope. None of those are necessary here. Oh, there's the shop I was discussing. Ooh, there is some stuff. Oh, 
There's one charge for each non question mark room. I do like question marks, but uh, apply two weeks whenever we play this card on the same three times. Apply once, stun. And next card. I mean, I feel like it's definitely a membership card. And then I think, I feel like Matroska is like $3 from being too expensive. Well, apparently five. I can't do math. But that'll be very good since we're only on the second floor. I think here. Almost. No, I actually think the strike here. This is like our main source of damage, and we need to continue adding them um, to make them relevant. And a rare relic. Take pain. We've not done the give a deck innate and auto play. I don't know what we would innately auto play, though. No, I think it's just another rare relic here. Ooh, spice. Okay. This is going to be interesting. We got Forgotten Sword Lady here, so we need to kill these babies. Um, I mean, Fiend Fire is a great way to start. Yeah, I think we Carnage, Fiend Fire, and then we put the extra damage against her. She can do a lot of damage here. Um, Eclipse here. Ooh, Demon Form? Hmm. Uh, loses 11 HP. Uh, and for block. Yeah, do that. Go ahead and cleave. I mean, we might as well demon form and war cry. We're still going to take the 18 damage, which is an insane amount to be dealing with on, you know, at this point in time. Oh my goodness. Oh, they gained five strength. Uh, okay. Bash. Ouch. I can only do 10. Yep. We are in pain. Not dead, but not far from it. Okay, um, yeah, let's just make sure they're dead. 18 damage here, I don't know exactly why. All right, we'll hit them for a good bit. Uh, I'd rather keep the ghostly armor in the deck, so we'll continue on to the strike. Oh, it's because we have demon form, that's why. And I think we're just gonna put the pressure on the backliner, yep. Okay, we do need a rest at some point. Disarm's pretty good. I'm actually going to take it, I think. Um, we won't get another rest until here, but I think I'll risk that. Ori Calcum's good. And Spice. I mean, that's max HP. Eventually, it'll become Strength. Oh, Scarecrow's hit pretty dang hard. And nine off the starting cuff. Uh, okay. I'm going to go with the... Uh, they're doing 18. Oh, we already got that covered. So we'll go for the two strikes here. Definitely need to get them down quickly. Uh, and I, I don't want them to exhaust. Actually, them exhausting cards honestly wouldn't be the worst thing. Carnage, I can blow you up. Ow, and the pain will continue to hurt me, though. Um, and we need 12 blocks, so do that. Um, disarm them for two. Uh, or pommel. How much am I going to take? One for each card plate. Right, it saves this one. I guess overall, Orichalcum might have been better. Oh, they are doing... 12. Not enough to kill us, but enough to... Make my day bad. Uh, let's do this here. This here. I don't think I'm going to play the bash, so let's, let's draw some. Okay. Interesting. I don't want to... Eclipse these two again. Um, I can't. Yeah, let's eclipse. Cause I, honestly, I really need block. And Fiend Fire didn't get killed anyway. Uh, True Grit's gonna hit something randomly. Gotta play it. Got the clash, unfortunately. Um, but that's fine. I think we have enough damage on board to really do something. I mean, I might as well Fiend Fire. I'll lose the headbutt, I guess. Actually, let's play the headbutt. And we'll put a card from discard. We'll put Carnage back on top of the deck. Let's just fiend fire all these. Because then they're going to get stronger. And this is all damage. Yep. 12 on you. 18. 26. Math worked out. Uh, another fiend fire. No, another strike right there. Alright, we're going to rest here. Just in case. Because I know this Jester Man is going to suck. And these elites sometimes can, uh, 
be pretty rough. Let's disarm you. Uh, you're doing 21 to me. Gross. Um, this is nine. Yeah. Yep. Uh, okay. Lock for nine. Ten. Ten. Okay. So, taking some here. I can't let them kill this this little this little man. Um, this is pretty good. Yep. Get rid of these two. I get rid of all three of these. Fiend fire is great. Or iron wind is great. And I think I will just fiend fire. We're going to lose a lot of attacks though. And this card exhausts. Let's play one of them and then we'll do the other one. I don't know what you're doing my friend. Because you're not eating this boy. Oh vomit. There we go. 13 to this one. Um, you must die now. Oh I can't kill them. That is without. I have to devote two attacks to kill them, which sucks. All right, they're out of the picture for right now. Um, I will ghostly armor to keep it. Yep, they're down 50 now. Trying to kill this one. Um, let's pommel first. Ow! Why did I take damage? Do 14 damage negative effect on you? No, I don't know why I took damage. Oh, I took it from the seventh bullet. I do that every time. All right, two strikes from health. Become free. Disarm. There we go. Because they're a new creature now. I, I'm feeling like just continuously laying the damage onto them. Um, War cry. Draw one card. Put one card from here on the top. Put this card on the top. That's fine. And then we'll sever here. Because if we can keep them off of killing this man, I'll kill the melted corpse eventually. Oh, they got, the, I guess, heal 12 is how that goes. Um, abandon. I just played it without- I wanted to get rid of the slime. For being honest. Uh, that's still gonna- No, we're not getting rid of it. Alright, 25 down to the last one. Uh, Carnage 30. Man, the seventh bullet is hurting us. Uh, spice. Just one more hit. Uh, lower our max HP by eight. Well, I mean, if we got it, use it. Take another spice. Okay, our max HP will get lower, but we're starting each combat with uh, two strength and two decks. And we're drawing an extra card, um, which negates the Royal Goblet. It might take spice to get us through this. We're adding one of 15 cards to our deck. Um, another, they, uh, here we go, right there. Boom. We might be hitting concentration on them, but at the same time, oh, pain is really being a pain. I gotta do this. All right, grab all these out. Boom. In flames, great. Uh... The top of your uh, play the top card of your draw pile and exhaust it. Sure. Bean fire. Okay. Game theory like this not block to buy block modifiers. Do I really? I mean, I guess I don't want to take ten. Might as well play it. And then yeah, let's start hitting, hitting you. And wounds really aren't going to affect me in like a ton of different ways. Twelve coming in. Disarm you. Um, you have 20. It's gonna take two cards to devoted to you. I can do 22 here. Then I get the bliss. Alright, and then I can hit you. I figured out how you do things. Oh, 36 here. Ugh. I need to kill you. For being honest. Uh, 21. And 12. Yep. That works. Also, I got to thinking about it. Um, <laughs> lower by eight more. One more time. Uh, let me know if the game sounds versus my audio are a little better. I tweaked them just a little bit. I noticed the last recording I did, um, I was, um, much quieter than the game. So I want to know what you guys think on that. I can tweak it a little bit, but I'm trying to do a little better on that front. Um, disarm for three is pretty good. Um, dum, 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 dum. Uh, I think we'll go pommel for two though. Common cards sometimes are the better choice. Okay, we need to get these minions on our side. Post haste. And then we're going to go with the carnage here. Uh, let's also drink. Not corruption. Dark embrace would be good. Dark embrace here. Seems better. And then, yeah, that's how we're going to start for now. 
Yeah, be careful because they once he kills our little minions, our ser our servants here, going to get pretty rough. So we want to block them when we can. Um, sever soul. Actually, abandon the stinking pain. Get it out of here. Annoying. Okay, the void will also be annoying, but we're gonna iron wave. We're gonna ghostly armor. We're going to defend. We'll strike here. And we're gonna give two, one, two. Um, and I can protect one even more. I don't know if it matters. Enemy deals triple damage to enemies without block, and you are just an ally. You get the additional block here. Alright. Erosion here. Um, what's erosion do? Not even apply a negative. Da, da, da. Receives three more damage from attacks reduced by one at the end of the round. So, okay, that's not bad either. This is not very good. I have no block. Okay. Really, if I had a way to exhaust this hand, I would be much better off. Um, overall, I think I go bash. I think I defend. And then I think I give up part of it. Can I give up all of it? I can. Which should make or Calcum in your turn with any block. Or Calcum live, I think. And it does. So I'm pretty much applying the vulnerability to... Actually, I don't know if I have applied any of them. Like, but I, that's all I can provide to my team in any, in any case. And they're weakened. Oh, 32 here? I have to block. Or I'm dead. Um, uh, We're going to go with the Eclipse, I think. Yeah, because Ori Calcum will keep us alive, technically. If we were to get nothing. Oh my goodness. Okay. We, uh, let's read some cards really quick. Um, Sword Boomerang is fine. Try to clear out my hand. Let's draw the card. Fiend Fire would be a lot of damage. Run through. Uh, loses 14. Fine. Let's go ahead and... Well, we'll, we'll save that. 26 to all enemies. Lose 5... Lose all strength. Like about five times my strength. Okay. So the only one that's going to benefit is the strike through health to abandon it. We're going to draw a bunch more cards. I don't really want to lose all my strength right now. Um, let's run through. Um, we need to block some. So let's. But then I can't play Fiend Fire. Let's abandon first. Abandon this. Okay, we drew some more. Play this for 25. Um, I massacre here. Uh, da, da, da. I'd lose five strength, I guess. But it's 26 damage. Let's save that in the deck for now. Let's go ahead and ghostly armor for 12 and we'll disarm actually. I think I prefer that better. Then we'll end the turn. Let them try to continue what they're doing. They're negated. This is a bad turn in terms of damage, but this is where we died last time, I think. But last time, both of these had these guys were gone, so um, we have that. Why? Oh, I took damage from seven bullets. Okay. Um, Iron Wave is more block than I'd gain from more Calcum. Uh, 18 is more than I can take and survive, I think, if my math is correct. At nine, so I have fifteen. I need to drink something here to survive. Um, none of these help me, so we'll barricade. But I healed a little bit there, actually. Go ahead and drink the other one. That puts me up to twenty-five. We're alive still. Uh, okay. Thirteen, fourteen, eleven. Why are you more damage? Oh, you're a strike plus. So we need to strike plus, I guess, and then that's it. Okay, here we do. We're gonna be hanging on by nine HP. But this is my goal: is to beat this, beat this man. Yeah, he's hitting my friend, but I can't get get past him. All right, sixteen to me. Uh, pommel strike first. Pommel strike again. Abandon maybe. Fiend fires fifteen times. Two, three, four, five, six. Fifteen times six is. Oh gosh, 60 plus 90? That's not enough. Not enough at all. Um, okay, abandon this. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 times that is 
80 plus 40, 120. Still not enough. These are 30, though. This is more damage than that. Hit him with that. This is 26, but then I'm going to lose a lot of damage. And I want to survive here is the problem. This is 7, so this puts me up to 16. I will still die unless I can get... This is also 6, which puts me up to 15. I'm one block short. Actually, I will draw a ton of cards if I do this, though. Because I'm going to exhaust all these cards. This becomes free. Okay. Okay, okay. Hit him with this. I'm going to draw a million cards. None of which I can play. Do that. Ow. I have six. 21 here. That's still it. No matter what I do. I think they have still... This dude has still bested me. But yeah, I get the six here. That was exhaust. I draw some cards. But I'm like five or six blocks short. Man. Joker wins again. Even with turning the ascension down, he is just a house. We couldn't do enough damage over time. We didn't exhaust enough cards. I guess we needed more exhaust in the build overall. Man. I think it's going to be a shorty today. I don't think we're going to start another one 37 minutes in, but that's going to do it for this episode, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. Um, again, down in the comments, if you'll let me know if this sounds any better. Um, I think I should be a little bit louder over the game. Um, if, if I need to tweak it a little bit, let me know what you guys think. But that's going to do it. I hope you guys did enjoy. Hit that like button if you did. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.